Hi, this is Nahi Rides from here with a special SBR iGaming News update. A ruling is expected by the end of the day from U.S. District Court Judge Michael Shipp in the New Jersey sports betting case. Now, we last interviewed State Senator Raymond Lesniak in September, who vowed that Monmouth Racetrack would be the first gaming property to accept sports wagers in New Jersey on October 26th. Now, unfortunately, the professional sports leagues and NCAA again filed a motion in New Jersey federal court seeking to stop this and were granted a temporary restraining order days before thousands were to attend Monmouth Racetrack to celebrate sports betting. Now, the officials at Monmouth Racetrack had completely renovated their sports bar and restaurant into a functional sports book, anticipating the launch, hired employees and even formed a regulation committee named the Independent Sports Association. Judge Shipp heard arguments Thursday from both the state and attorneys for the sporting leagues and must now decide if the temporary restraining order will be lifted or if preliminary injunction will be put in place. Now, either way, this is likely going to move to the Third Circuit Court of Appeals and it may be another six-month process before there is another significant update. Sportsbook Review will keep readers up to date on all the New Jersey internet gambling and sports betting news. For Sportsbook Review, I'm Natalie Rydstrom. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year-round, a real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.